Okay. So this question goes to I'll be choosing people right for la she know. She know, can you hear me? Why is she not always responding, please? She I don't know. Does he respond in class? In um, first classes? No. It, yeah, it depends. Sometimes. It depends. Because this is going to be like the third time I'll be calling on him. No response. So definitely, it is his computer that is present in the class, not in himself. Right? So let us go to the business. The first question I'll be throwing this question to you. You see? You see why I like muting all of you on mute? You see? Fola, are you with us? Suspicion. Sir. Fola is oh. Is my kids. Is is muting and on mute. I don't think he's there. So who is doing that? The network cannot be helping you to mute and unmute, right? You should tell for that he has some cases to to answer. Okay. Now this question goes to Kemi. Kemi, this question is for you. The following are examples of empires in pre-colonial Africa. Ex please, if I didn't mention your, or if I don't mention your name, don't respond. If I don't mention your name, don't respond. Until you feel the person is wrong, then politely signify. Is that right? The following is are examples of empires. In I can't hear you. Angela is probably your nature. Anybody can hear? Everybody can you hear me? Yes, yes sir. So, uh -huh. sir. Say it again. I, I didn't hear you. So the question is, I said these are the rules. I said if I don't call on you, don't answer. Is that correct? Okay. So, because I want, um, yes. I want us to be orderly. Okay. So this question goes to Kemi. Okay. Kemi. The following are examples of empires in pre-colonial Africa, except A, Ghana, B, Mali, C, Songhai, D, Benin, E, Daomi. Kemi. Mm. What? Uh, hello. Kemi, Kemi. What's your answer? Mm -hmm. Your answer is C. C is some guy. The question is saying four out of five options are pre colonial empires, are empires in pre colonial Africa, except one. So, A, Ghana, B, Mali, C, Songhai, D, Benin, E, Daomi. D. D, Benin. Is that your final answer? Yes. Does anybody, Angela? Angela, let's talk this back. Shoma? Shoma? What, what is the answer to that question? Angela, I know it. Please, if I don't Angela, know it, we have moved on to Shoma. Shoma? Are we together? Can't you hear me? Oh. Yeah. Network is, I need active network. Let me move on to IFM. Unmute yourself. IFM. Network is also active. IFM, unmute yourself. I'm participating. So I was not. Answer correct. No, no, Kemi. I want somebody to, to give the correct answer. 
IFM is not also active. You see? Yes, sir. Sir. Sir, me. Angela, okay. Can you speak? Sir. Yes. <coughs> Angela, what is the answer? What is the answer? Angela, Angela, what is the answer? What is the answer? Let us move on to Femi. Nah. Oh, yeah, me. Dao me. Okay, she has answered the question. She said is Dao me. Dao me. Yes. Is the, is the answer. Yeah, she's correct. Ghana, Kemi, can you hear me? Ghana, in pre-colonial Africa, Ghana was an empire. Mali was an empire. Songhai was an empire, right, Angela? And when you're talking about empire, we also had Benin Kingdom. Yes, sir. Benin Kingdom, too, was like an empire, or was an empire. But in the history of Africa, never will you hear somebody say that will be kingdom or that will be empire. In fact, there was a time that Naomi was under your empire. Do you get it? Do you yes, get sir. it? Yes, sir. Yes, Good. sir. Let us move on to the next one. Are you a me on mute? Yes. <laughs> Sheriff, you're on mute. Yes. This question goes to um the following are characteristics of empire except a centralized leadership b large territories c wide trade network d weak military e robust economy which which is not a characteristic of Star, an can you go through it again? I, I didn't a, hear you. Centralized leadership, B, large territories, C, wide trade network, D, weak military, E, robust economy. Which which of those options are not or which of those options is not a characteristic characteristic of an empire? Sir, please repeat it. A, weak military. Weak military. Why? Why? Why did you choose weak military? Sir, I repeat it. And uh, the question is: the following are uh, characteristics of empire. I said a centralized leadership. B, light territory, C, white trade network, D, weak military, E, robust economy, and Isha Lua said weak military. Why did you choose weak military? Why did you choose weak military? You can phone a friend. Yes, that's another rule. You can phone a friend. Yeah, to help fast. Phone a friend. Dara. Dara. Oluan Dara. Yes. Why? Okay. Sir, not all the militaries of the empire were weak. Mm. No, or you can say, an empire, for an empire to be an empire, that means they have a strong military. So what, one of the characteristics of an empire is strong military. So I only chose the opposite yes, of sir. it. So which makes it odd. Okay? So an empire usually has... Uh, um, uh, an empire usually has centralized leadership, right? They have strong leadership. They have large territories. They also have wide trade network. When we discussed the Ghana Empire, we discussed the um, Songhai Empire, we discussed the Mali Empire, we realized that all these things are applicable to them. They have centralized leadership. In Mali, for example, we have the Mansa, right? Mansa. 
as the head of government, and they also have large territories. Uh, as a result of that, due to the fact that they conquer, they conquer uh, weaker states. So as a result of that, they have faster states under them, which makes them, um, which makes their territory a large one. And we also have wide trade network. One of the factors that brought about rises of empire uh, or the rise of empire was um, was a wide trade network. Okay. So and of course they also have robust economy. So weak military is out. Oh, thank you, um, Ishalua. Now let us go to this question goes to David Abbott. David, are you with us? Mr. David. Yes, sir. All right. The question yes, is Ghana Empire covered the following modern day countries, except Ghana Empire covered the following modern day countries, except A, Ghana. B, Mauritania, C, Senegal, D, Mali, E, Nigeria. Following modern day. So the following modern day what? Countries. How about, um, are you, should I repeat the Senegal. question? Senegal. Senegal, is that your final answer? No. Is that your final answer? You know, when, when we're looking at the geographical location of these empires, we said, we said that uh, the old Ghana empire covered some modern day countries in Africa, in the geographical space of Africa. In the geographical space of Africa, such as we have, oh, you're here, I'm putting you on mute and you're muting yourself. You're distracting us. Okay. So we have Ghana, we have Mauritania, we have Senegal, we have Mali, we have Nigeria. Which one is not or was not part of the old Ghana Empire? That's the question. Mauritania. Mor huh? Oh, Yeni, no. Joseph or Mito Yeni. Oh. You're wrong, um, uh, um, David. Who can who can put us through, please? Let me call on if Paul. Hmm. If Senegal. 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 Yeah. If Epo, you're wrong. Who said Senegal? No, sir. If Epo, this is Senegal. Sir, that was not no, if Epo. That was Timilene. But I told you that if I don't call on you, don't speak. Why is it that it is difficult for you guys to follow simple instructions? If Epo, are you with me? Timilene. If Epo. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So, what's the answer, please? What's the I'm answer? I'm coming, sir. Ah, you, want to call, you want to look at your desk? No, 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 sir. No, sir. Yes, I'm not my desk book, sir. So, what do you want to do? Which... I'm not looking at my desk book, sir. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, the answer is Mauritania. I disagree. Who disagree? I disagree. Yes, Mauritania I disagree. Was not part. I disagree. Okay, okay, let Damiloju. Let Damiloju give us. Damiloju, why? What's the answer? What's the answer? Nigeria. Nigeria. And why is it Nigeria? Um, sir, because in the, if you ch in the notes, you said. Um, Mali Empire was sorry, Ghana Empire was, um, were, was in uh, modern day countries like Mali, Mauritania, Senegal, and Ghana. And Nigeria was not part of what you gave us in the I race. could ask you this question in your theory to make it tough because I know some of you will not pay attention to that detail. I would say least three countries that we are part of old Ghana Empire. Or I could say at least three countries that were part of old Mali Empire. Mali, depends Mauritania, on, and Sudan. Depart, depends Tell on where, go. where Tell we go. So we have, the answer is Nigeria. Nigeria was in part of old Ghana Empire. Do you get it? Now, this yes, question sir. goes to Ola Body at ABC. The question is, 
Ghana Empire was founded in about A, 400 AD, Anno Domino, 500 Anno Domino, C, 600 Anno Domino, D, 700 Anno Domino, E, 800 Anno Domino. 400 Anno Domino. 400 Anno Domino. Is she right or right? Is she right or wrong? Right. 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 B, Shaka Zulu, C, Swahili, D, Basoto, E, Lesoto. Sonike. Sonike people, yes. You said the Sonike people founded Ghana. So I don't think Man. it was, I think someone no, was. I think we'll get to it. Ah, someone answered. So that was not so someone that. answered on my behalf. Who spoke? I think. You see, you I see, let's have people who say I should not put everybody on me. Why, why do I do that? I mean, everybody. I'm changing me. my mind. Yes. You know, I told me what I'm sorry. Happy. Uh -huh. you are yes, free to, sir. You are free to speak. Let me give you the question. Somebody has already made the question, so I will ask you another one. Ghana was initially referred to as A, Wagadu, B, Ghana, C, Black Stars. D, Asante, E, Kwame. Are you there? Seems not to be you, girls. Are you there? You're, why are you on mute? Unmute yourself, bro. And I want to tell you I was on mute. So the answer is Wagadu. Wagadu, yes, Wagadu, Wagadu. Correct, correct. This next question goes to the next question goes to Daniel. Unmute yourself. Daniel, unmute yourself. The question is the capital city of ancient Ghana. The capital city of ancient Ghana was A, Gold Coast, B, Tema, C, Kumbi Saleh. D. Wagadu, E. Asante. Yes. Daniel. I can't hear you. You can't hear me. Your network is bad. I can't also, I can barely hear you also. Let us move to Williams. Williams, Daniel, please. I want you to pay attention. Even if your network is um, weak. Williams, unmute yourself, yes? Your question is, the capital city of ancient Ghana was A, Gold Coast, B, Tema, C, Kumbi Sale, D, Wagadu, E, Asante. Yes? Sir Williams. Sir Williams. Mr. Williams. It's okay. Yeah, I think the network is bad. Williams, can you hear me, please? Yes, sir. All right. So I said the question is: the capital city of ancient Ghana was A. Gold Coast, B. Tema, C. Kumbisale, D. Wagadu, E. Asante. Kumbisale. 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 You're correct. The next question goes to um, Domiloju. Why are you typing? Where is that Domiloju? Let me unmute Your You're answering the next question. OJ, right? Or meet yourself. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Your question is: the word Ghana means a 
war b liquid metal c war chief d military lord e none of the above um the word ghana means a war b liquid metal c war chief d military lord e none of the above Ghana means none of the above. None of the above. Are you no, sure? No, sir. Wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not sure. I'm waiting. You don't have time. Mm, sir, can you see the options again? The options are war, B, liquid metal, C, war chief. D, military law, E, none of the above. I think none of the above. Okay. I'm picking. Who is this? The light. No, no, you are wrong. If I tell you not to talk, don't talk, don't type. Uh uh. Yes, I can see people raising up their hands, but I still have the veto power to choose. Sheriff. Sheriff, unmute yourself, please. Turn off. So, in old Ghana Empire, gold was deposited in A. In old Ghana Empire, Gold was deposited in A. Wangara, B. Wagadu, C. Gold Coast, D. Tagaza, E. Kumbi Saleh. Sharif, you're on mute. On mute yourself. Yes, sir. Yes? Tagaza. Tagaza. Is that your final answer? Tagaza? Is Tagaza correct? Yes, sir. Does anybody have a different answer? Um, Uluanda, do you have a different answer? No, sir. Is Tagaza? Yes. Wait, sir, please say the question again. Sorry, sir, I didn't get the question. Where was, gold, where was gold deposited in old Ghana Empire? Oh, sorry, it's correct. Does anybody have a different opinion? BC? BC, yes? Wangara. 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 Yes, that... That was why I was asking. Does anybody have a, because it was wrong? Wangara. Uh, Grace, you want to say something? Grace, yes. So I wanted to say Wangara. Wangara, yes, Wangara. All right, this question goes to Grace. Grace, have I thrown any question at you directly? No, sir. All right, this question goes to Grace. The next question will be going to um, I saw somebody now, Fashi Demi. So Fashi Demi, I'm meeting you. Get to get. All right. Uh, Grace, your question is, in Ghana Sir? Empire, salt was largely deposited in A, Wagadu, B, Wangara, C, Tagaza, D, Kumbisale, E, Salt Coast. Tagaza. Tagaza. Yes, sir. Does anybody have a different opinion? Anybody with a different opinion? Different answer? Damn, Logi said she's correct. Tagaza. Angela, you want to say something? Angela, what do you want to say? Repeat the question. 
I said, in Ghana Empire, salt was lightly deposited in A, Wagadu, B, Wangara, C, Tagaza, D, Kumbisale, E, Salt Coast. Um. All right, BC, is she correct? Oluanda, is she correct? Can we, do you agree? I think the network is fluctuating. Are, are we together, guys? Please hold on. All right, this question goes to Fashi Bibi. Yes, Tagaza. You know, when we're, when we're discussing Mali Empire, Tagaza was one of the important cities they had, right? One of the important cities of Mali Empire. So, and Mali Empire seized that city from Ghana Empire. Fashi Bibi, where are you? Why should they? Why should they? I can't find them in there. Okay, mm -hmm. here. Mosho, pray. Unmute yourself. Yes, sir. All right. The question is. The question is the following contributed to the rise of old Ghana Empire. One, the, the following um, contributed to the rise of Ghana Empire, said to one, A, geographical location, B, trans-Saharan trade, C, fertile land, D, availability of nuclear weapon, E, gold and salt. Fashion in. Now to C. C is fertile land. Let me repeat it again. A, geographical location. B, trans saharan trade. C, fertile land. B, availability of nuclear weapon. E, gold and salt. That's C. C, fertile land. Any contradicting answer? Does anybody have a different answer? Let me call. Let me call. Uh, oh, not be ye. Unmute yourself, sir. Unmute yourself, sir. And participate, sir. Oh, not be ye. Unmute yourself, please. Mm -hmm. Maybe his network is not helping. Let me call on. Uh, okay, since Kemi missed the first question, Kemi, do you have any opinion to this? Yes. Kemi, what's the answer? Four out of the following, except one. Oh, sorry. Five out of the following, except one, contributed to the rise of the Ghana Empire. We are looking at the factors that led to the rise of Ghana Empire. Is it geographical location? Yes, sir. Is it trans saharan trade? Oh, no, sorry. I'll be given five options, but one is not the answer. We are looking at factors that led to Ghana Empire. Geographical location, trans saharan trade, fertile land, availability of nuclear weapon, gold and salt. What's your answer? So the answer is uh, 
Availability. Tell us A. A is geographical location. B is transparent trade. C is fertile and D is availability of nuclear weapon. E is gold and salt. So rice, rice. Yes. Rice. Yeah. Trans-Saharan trade. Who is this damn Luigi? I thought I gave you guys instruction that if I don't follow you, don't answer the question. Damiloju said it's nuclear weapon. Actually, if I don't call on you, because the question is not going to go around. So when somebody misses it, you give room for another person. It's not a competition, okay? It is for everybody to learn. Nobody is competing here, right? And nobody is showing off that, okay, I know more than you. What you know, what A knows, B might not know it. And what B knows might be alien to A. You understand? So let us give room for group learning. That's why I'm doing that. It's not because I don't want you to shine in the class. Or I know some of you are history gurus. You understand? So, but at least let us give room for everybody. All right. This question goes to, yeah, so the answer is availability of nuclear weapon. Yes. Ghana Empire did not. There was something like nuclear weapon in Colonia Africa. Okay? So, now this question goes to Damilola Dipe. Damilola Dipe. Yes, sir. Are you with us? Yes. Mali Empire developed as a result of the collapse of what empire? A, Songhai Empire, B, Ghana Empire, C, Kane Bronu Empire, D, Benin Empire, E, or your empire? That's Songhai. Songhai Empire. Is that your final answer? Yes. Is that your final answer? Yes. You're wrong. Let us listen to someone else. Uh, Adebayo. I saw Adebayo just now. Adebayo. Okay. Adebayo, mute yourself. Yes, sir. So what is the answer? Can you please repeat the question? The question is, the question is, Mali Empire developed as a result of the collapse of A, Songhai Empire, B, Ghana Empire, C, Kane Bonu Empire, D, Benin Empire, E, or your empire? Ghana Empire. Ghana Empire. If you agree with her, thumbs up. If you agree with her. Okay, majority seems to agree with you. So yes, Ghana Empire was the first empire we discussed, followed by Mali. And we said, Mali Empire, are you with me? Um, yeah, at the